colorectal cancer is the third leading cause of cancer-related deaths worldwide. Despite significant advancements in its management, which have led to a 91% survival rate when detected early, it continues to claim over 900,000 deaths annually. Established screening methods for colorectal cancer include colonoscopy and advanced technologies like FDA-approved stool DNA or ctDNA blood tests. However, due to availability or compliance issues in Asian countries, many at-risk individuals fail to undergo regular screenings, leading to a high percentage of late-stage detections. Multi-cancer early detection MCED tests available in Asia, such as the spot mass test, can identify ctDNA signals from colorectal tumors and other aggressive cancers. This enables timely follow-up with diagnostic imaging and early surgical intervention. In our clinical validation study starting in 2022, we conducted an MCED blood test for an 80-year-old female volunteer with no personal or family history of cancer and no presenting symptoms. At her age, the patient could hardly undergo colonoscopy as annual screening tool due to its invasive nature. A simple blood test for multiple cancers can help physicians guide further diagnostic imaging tests if needed. Her spot mass ctDNA test result indicated potential tumor presence in the colorectal and breast areas. Based on this insight, she was advised to undergo a colonoscopy as part of the test protocol. During the colonoscopy, a large polyp was discovered in the transverse colon, measuring between 2 to 2.5 centimeters. The polyp had a broad base with a smooth surface and uniform glandular structure. A polypectomy was performed. Additionally, a tumor with ulcerative features and firm consistency was found in the ascending colon, occupying about one-third of the colon's lumen. A biopsy was taken from this lesion for further analysis. The biopsy results revealed that the transverse colon polyp consisted of strongly proliferative glandular structures forming tubular glands, with relatively uniform cells and mild atypia. The tumor in the ascending colon was diagnosed as a low-grade adenocarcinoma, characterized by strong glandular proliferation and significant cellular atypia, with mucinous differentiation. The findings confirmed true positive ctDNA signals, consistent with stage 2 colorectal cancer. She subsequently underwent surgical removal of both the cancerous and precancerous polyps. Elderly individuals over 75 years old are not typically recommended for invasive cancer screening methods such as colonoscopy. Therefore, a non-invasive, available test like spot mass provides significant support to elderly patients, improving their quality of life by enabling early detection and timely intervention.